Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. It's a snapshot, so it's a daily snapshot. This one here is for the sign of Aries for July 8th, 2020. Um, before we do begin, this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everybody. So please do take what resonates with you and just leave the rest aside. Um, if you would like to have a private reading, you do have some questions you would like to have answered please feel free to contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com and it will be my great pleasure to um, provide you with the information on the different types of readings that I can uh, perform for you and also how to book them. Uh, one last thing, if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel. It's my only way of knowing that you enjoy my channel and that you support my channel. So if you want to show me your support, please do subscribe. It's very appreciated. So with no further ado, we're going to begin. I am with a bunch of wisdom here. I'm filled of wisdom. So this is a wisdom uh, oracle that we're going to be doing here today. And it's going to be for the relationship okay it's relationship oriented so I feel as though yours is right here my dear friend Aries and you have the observer okay so the observer is really you know about the perspective it's about uh, objectivity it's about being neutral it's observation from a distance you're observing so you know sometimes you just can't see the forest for the trees in your way Feelings can get, you know, all jumbled up and often you hear one thing when a person says another. It can be like an echo of an unresolved past experience that is dubbed over your conversation that keeps going over and over and over again. So, you know, this is time to take uh, take time out, okay, before you react at all times. And um, it's likely the other person has no idea how his or her words have affected you. So take a few steps back and lend understanding to the situation. Have faith in your connection and trust that you can come together, okay? Take to the higher ground now and cultivate curiosity, be a curiosity about what you observe in yourself in others also, and in the landscape and everything that you do see around you. So you're going to find things are much better. They're going to be improved sooner than you know if you do apply this. So you need to apply the when you're upset. Don't overreact. Just take a break. Go away. Look around you. Observe. Enjoy. Have gratitude for what you do have. And then come back and you'll see it'll be much better. So um, I do wish you a fantastic day. I hope that you enjoyed the message. I hope you will apply it today because this is the point of the daily snapshots. Um, have a great, great day. Please don't forget to subscribe and we'll be seeing each other very soon for another reading. So tomorrow, have a great day.